on my phone called Yu-Gi-Oh! Duelings. It's just a game that I play for fun um, when I'm bored or I'm not working or we're working on my music education courses or anything like that. Um, I didn't really have any problems downloading it. it. Usually I have my app store that will automatically update it for me. So I don't usually have any problems of that sort if it, for whatever reason, shuts down in the middle of my time using it or anything like that. I would, like, shut the app off and then restart it and then just be fine. But if the problem persists, I would contact the manufacturer or the company that's um, taking care of it, and I would email them saying, hey, I have a problem. Uh, keep shutting down. They say they would take care of it. So I don't really have that problem a whole bunch. On my Kindle, every now and then it'll ask me if I want to update um, my Dragon game that I have or my Spotify that I use a ton for my music. Um, and then, yeah, I will have to say that I want this updated. But that's really all that goes on with that. Um, before today, I guess you could say, I've never really given thought of using a PDF. Um, I use Google Chrome um, Print Save As PDF, just going the easy way. I didn't really want any more software on my computer that I wasn't going to be using a whole bunch, so I just thought to do the easy way. Um, I have a theory teacher. Well, I used to have a theory teacher, I guess I should say now, since I'm not taking theory anymore. I would use a PDF a whole bunch, like for her quizzes, for her assignments, um, for her scores or her handouts that she would want to print off so that she would use PDF more than say uh, me or some of my classmates. Uh, on top of that, uh, in a classroom, maybe the only thing I can really think of is maybe using rhythms. I don't really believe in using a screen to show um, what the rhythms are. I believe I'm on the hands-on because that's what I want to do. I was going to teach K-3 through three and then a high school band, and most of that will be hands-on. So I don't see myself using PDF a whole bunch, to be perfectly honest. Uh, have I ever used a webcam before? Yes, I have. I On my personal channel, my YouTube, I have a video of, you, of me playing my flute to uh, You'll Be In My Heart by Phil Collins from the movie Tarzan. But it's not me. It's not what I'm showing you right now. It's just the audio, and then I have a cover picture because I, I have done um, other videos and I've gotten some very critical and harsh reviews, even though I, that, that, that's common now. I just, as a kid, I didn't take it very well. So I just kind of pushed it away, didn't, decided not to touch it anymore for a while. So I just usually do montages. Um, I never really had any trouble. Uh, believe it or not, on, um, on the Fort Hay State Marching Tigers um, YouTube page, I am the... Um, administrator, I'm the uploader of this, so I usually just take videos that come on an SD card that somebody else will videotape for me, um, so I don't really deal with webcam a whole bunch. Uh, like I said before, I don't see myself using video camera or PDF or anything like that a whole bunch, because I do believe in the version of a hands-on. If I were to even touch a, a video camera, it would probably be like a tutorial of like a like of a note, like this note gets so many beats per measure, um, all that fine sorts of stuff. I don't see myself doing anything else. Um, that's me. Hope you guys enjoyed.